grew older so I don't know whether H&M still carries it So hard to wear it and not getting laughed at Mom, I'll never buy this from you again Hi guys! Welcome to my channel um, this is my first ever YouTube uh, video that I'll be uploading on my YouTube channel. Hi, if you haven't seen me before, I'm Zoe. Um, okay, so let's start with my first pair. These. These shoes are like my biggest hype currently. Like, I wear them every single day now. Like, they're just like... Because I'm actually 5 foot, like 5 foot, that's so short for a girl but like, you know, we'll just deal with their jeans, blah 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 and stuff. So these shoes, they're actually like um, replicas of Converse but they're super high heel. Like you can actually see how thick the platform is, like how, you know. So like when I wear these, I literally feel like a giant and that's why I love them so much. Just I definitely need a bit of heel to it and I just love this devilish color like the black and the red it literally matches so well like if you can see like that's how like nice it goes together and like yeah i just love how it's so like it's like a statement on its own like i wish i could wear these like every day and they're so comfortable and yeah so like i realized like when i grew older well what do you mean grew older zoe you're 18 stupid like you can't grow like that's so young so like yeah I actually wear these every single day. You will not like find you will not catch me in a mall without like these kicks. They're literally so good. Okay. Okay, also like for all the shoes that I'm saying, I will link them down if I can remember the store of where I bought them from. If not, they're either from like thrift stores or like from this random store that I stopped by in like some other country when I was flying when I was um on holiday. So I will if I I will put like the the name of the store, the blah blah blah, how much it was, um, in the description box below. Okay, next. Okay, next. Shoe. These shoes were my biggest hype. Like, I begged, I practically begged my parents to like, get me these sandals. Cause they were just so nice, like, they're obviously a bit like, deformed now. They're like, obviously a little less like, what they used to be, but honestly, I just feel so much love for them. Like, even though they're like, the freaking hardest to wear, they are the beauties, okay? These are from H&M, like, I don't know whether H&M still carries it, but these sandals, I used to call them like Spartan sandals, like can you guys see it, like zoom in. I used to call these like Spartan sandals just because my dad used to call like Spart uh, these the Sparta sandals. And so I've been like loving these so much, like I think I've been wearing them ever since I was, um, I was like 13 or something. Yeah, these sandals, they are the ish, they used to be like super silver but as you know, the quality obviously have worn out and like five years has passed and like they're not so good anymore but I would recommend like totally get one like if H&M still has this and yeah like the downside to this is like the sad part is that they literally have no heel like they literally are just like a flat piece of wood that's all they are but then the design is what caught me so like I was literally like get these for me mom like I was so eager so yeah Nostalgic piece of sandals. Next! Oh my god, I want to get into this so bad. Like literally, these boots were the thing. Like in my whole Spain and Portugal trip. trip like they were my ish. Like if you guys follow my Instagram, if you don't follow it now, like, I'll have it in the description description box below. You can see through my highlights where I posted all my vlogs on my on my highlights. And they're literally, like, the best thing ever. So, you'll see these boots. These boots are literally what saved me throughout the entire trip of Spain and Portugal. Like, it was raining so heavily in Spain and Portugal. Like, it was raining cats and dogs, like, almost every day. Especially in Porto and Portugal. And they were, like, the lifesaver, you know. I could literally step on puddles and nothing would happen, like, to me. Because they were like, they are so nice, like they're so good quality, they're such a good quality. And I think, if I'm not mistaken, I bought these boots uh, uh, through a 
a brand called Seaside in Spain and they're actually like Doc Martens lookalikes but they're not because your girl's not bougie enough to get Doc Martens like hello so yeah I totally sound like a basic white bitch but you know what and yeah so these right their laces are like so um the black laces I actually found them in white but they didn't look as good so and these, if you, my camera like does it justice, is actually a mahogany like brown. I don't know whether you guys can see it clearly, but hold on. Yeah, they're like a mahogany brown and I'm so excited because they're such a like a maroon fun color as opposed to like black because I know a lot of people love like black boots but like these boots are the ish man. Like I think I would keep them for like 10 years. Just because I love them so much and like the thing is wearing it in Malaysia, it's like so hard to wear it and not getting laughed at because if I, I bet you, me going down the streets with these boots, people think that like I'm crazy or something. So yeah, I actually love these, like these boots have a special place in my heart, like they do, they do. Yeah, so I'm just sad that I haven't been able to wear this like as much as I wanted to in Malaysia, but that's fine. Okay. Okay, next up, oh my god. Okay, I'm going to be talking about my high cut sneakers. And you guys know, I have so many high cut sneakers, like they literally have like a spot in my heart. Just cause they're so underrated, like high cut sneakers are the thing. Okay, so I have these high cut sneakers. They look like a denim kind of material. And they are like a jeans kind of like wash, like blue, like white wash denim. And they are. So like they actually look so good. Like and the here's the thing, like the it's like orange with like blue and the and the inside is actually like an orange color, which is what got me. And these pair of shoes were actually they actually my mom bought it for me, like when she was in overseas. So I don't know I exactly remember the shop. But yeah, like when my mom bought this for me like in i think last year it was either last year or two years ago i literally could not stop wearing them for like weeks i would like cling on to them everywhere and so the thing is like with these high cut like i used to think that like high cut sneakers don't look good on me because i literally have like the life like very short legs but then the like i usually just tighten them around my ankle air not my ankle like my my ankle my leg area so that it's tighter and you could see like um, so it's like it fits like my leg better so that's why I love these so much and they literally have like the best like they go with any outfit you can literally wear like the the most unique most like I don't know like most unique most extra outfit and this would go with them so yeah Next one is like similar to the past, I mean the last sneakers, they're also blue but they're different just cause they have like this checkered design and the print on this is what got me, like these pair of shoes also my mom got for me just cause my, I love you mom, like you literally buy so much stuff for me but okay. So this checkered like design is so good, like it's what like caught me. And like my mom, I, I told my mom like, yeah, but just buy it, just buy it, just cause I love these so much. And this, and together with the black, like the, sorry, the blue sneakers from just now, I will alternate between days and then I will literally like choose which one to wear on that day. Just cause high cut sneakers were so my thing in 2019, like for the first half of 2019. And that's why I love these so much. Like, come on man, these shoes, look at them. And so they were so good. On to heels! Oh my god, heels. So, if you don't know, I actually just took them, took these boots out to wear on just one day, that, that one day, out of like that fifth, that like 19 days in my trip, I literally took these boots out like on one day. And the reason was because, number one, I did not know that Portugal had so many cobbled streets 
So I was literally like, uh, like I didn't have the chance to wear these like until I got to Bellum. And that's why I got to wear these and they're like the, f the most fun boots ever. Like, come on, man. Oh, they're so nice. And they have like a pointed toe, which is like an extra added like thing. So like they make your legs look longer. And that's why I'm so excited. I was so excited to wear these when I wore them like once. I'll definitely be wearing them like here more often, I guess. Because it's a it has like a very high heel to it. And like, it's not exactly comfortable. But like, I guess sometimes you have to sacrifice because not everything is comfortable. And so I think I I will need to wear these more often um, here in Malaysia when I get the chance. And they're literally the most like look like they're literally the most how to say it, like the most um majestic thing ever. Like they look so like precious. Yeah, and that's my like white boots. <laughs> silver heels but like I don't know what's the craze about that but yeah I basically I have these pair of heels that I got from like a few years ago and I did wear this to like a few important functions and events but here's the thing about these shoes they make your leg ache so much just cuz like the literally this like heel thing is like so thin so legit, whenever I walk, I literally have to like hold something and like, you know, when it gets like longer, like it hurts my feet. But then it's still like a nice addition and like, I think I'll probably sell these soon, but they're still good, you know, like they're, you know, I'll probably get myself an, a, like another silver heel though. Sorry, man. Yeah. <laughs> sandals i literally begged my mom to like get me these sandals when i was oh <laughs> sorry i literally begged my mom to get me these sandals when i was on trip in bangkok and she did and literally these are like the most beautiful sandals i've ever seen like they literally are like rhinestones and like jewels on it like that's how classy this is like if i were to be a shoe this would not be me because this is so classy and like luxurious and like look at it it's like shiny and I actually I haven't been wearing this as much as I wanted to like wait let me think when was the last time I wore like an actual sandal yeah like I have not been wearing sandals so like yeah I'll promise to wear these like more often because they're literally like the best thing ever look at them they're so cute and you, they could literally go with any dress like like any dress, like any white color, like I'm imagining like a white pastel, like sleeveless dress together with these, like on the beach with your boyfriend, you guys are like holding hands, that's so cute kind of thing, yeah. So yeah, love these shoes. <laughs> look like I would definitely wear these to an interview kind of thing yeah these shoes I just think that they look so like basic but at the same time they have like these unique like details like the zip on it and like the gold zipper like all these gold details and the cap toe make it look so like so basic but like you know like a must-have in your like like clo uh, like your shoe closet your shoe wardrobe and like these look so freaking classy like I would definitely wear this to an interview or like, you know, like a job kind of like function thing. They're so like non-haram, you get what I mean? They're like so nice and like love their little details. Of designer shoes like from Milan like me and my mom like we got this in Milan like my mom got it for me 
just because she said that like even though these were so expensive like she wanted me to have like I think it was because I don't know what I did like I probably did like a good deed or like probably got a good achievement and she decided to buy this for me and so these are the basically the nicest things but because I haven't been taking care of them properly like the jewels have been like you know going missing and I'm such a like a careless one so I feel like mom don't ever buy this for me again so these like jewels um you know it kind of fell off but it still looks good and the second thing that's really sad about this shoe is that they only had it in a one size and I just had to get it because I was like so stubborn and they're literally a size 39 I'm not even a size 39 I'm a size 36 so like that's how um bad it is but look at it it's so nice like do you guys get like get me when you see like a type of like silverish like platinum kind of shoes like I know it's very dirty now but they literally look so good like, uh, I should wash these and like keep like, I don't know, I should probably wash this and like make like a frame it up, you know. I don't think I'll be ever wearing this just because of like comfort reasons, uh, no not comfort, just because of like um, convenient, like it's not very convenient to wear these shoes and also because they're not my size. So like I'm really sad, like anyone who wants this shoe I'll give it to you. Uh, okay. <laughs> Okay, these shoes, this pair of shoes, I got from Shanghai when I was on a trip there. And these were like so glittery and f glitter, glittery and fun. So I thought I just had to get these because like it was really in trend at the time, like glitter shoes. So I was like, you know what, I'll get these because they're so glittery and fun. And I just thought like, oh my god, like if you guys can't see it, it's actually so glittery. But they're so worn out, like literally... Like, these were, like, my hype. Like, if I just wanted something comfortable and, like, just to slip in, I would literally get these pair of shoes just because they were so nice. And, like, you know, fashion. So, like... But now I don't really wear them anymore. Like, I don't even... I haven't even worn it for, like, the past year. So, like, I, I promise you'll get... Like, I'll probably give them to my cousin or, like, you know, someone who will appreciate them more. <laughs> having much much more like fun and like lovely like you know content whenever you guys want so just give me any sort of like feedback stuff that you want me to do during videos i know like challenges and stuff like i would be up for it and like just leave it at the comments below like drop anything you like yeah so bye guys bye see you in your video remember to follow remember to like like subscribe and comment down below and let's get this video up to a thousand views shall we and also follow my social media and like check it out if like you want any like fashion inspo or like just things that I do in my daily life because it will be fun and I vlog every day on my Instagram. So, bye!